Good morning, folks. We are enjoying a bit of space weather quiet, but as you can see, more sunspots are incoming. We also have notes on the cold weather records set in the western United States, a look at upcoming presentations at the EGU, and the cosmic dust. But we begin with our star. The next space weather is coming from the central coronal hole. It's sliding behind the Earth scale there. Its magnetic fields are connecting to Earth today, and its solar wind will arrive over the weekend more geomagnetic activity is expected. It can help to contrast the SDO views, 171 angstroms on the left, 211 on the right. While the first shows the active regions as the bright arced areas, the latter shows the deep coronal dynamics like the coronal hole currently facing Earth. This is why it's critical to have these various ultraviolet views of our star. We will keep an eye open in the coming days for the solar wind enhancement from that coronal hole stream and more flaring activity from the new incoming active regions, plus any plasma filament eruptions that do occur. Folks, the Hollywood sign took snow for the second time in a week. The winter blast has broken both cold records and snow records over the last couple days, to the amusement of some and the dismay of those who expected certain highways to be open and weren't. Good article on the cold data at coldweatherreport.com, by the way. Check that out. Folks, in the coming days, we will be going over the top upcoming presentations at EGU 2023. There's going to be a bunch of good ones, and they indicate the shift in mindset of the geophysics field, like this one, which will model a super flare impact during a geomagnetic pole shift, which, of course, is a scenario expected in the coming years. Lastly, on the article front, we have official data from the Solar Orbiter on dust amounts, including how much is from interior asteroids and how much is the background component. This is a perfect baseline to be compared to future readings to continue measuring the amount of dust increasing in the inner solar system. We'll be looking for that in the coming years as well. A reminder that only the Buffalo and San Diego events have room left on our Blitz tour starting in about two weeks. Can't wait to see you guys out there. Link to get your tickets is below. And folks, today is the last day to get the discount on some of our Observer gear. It is about to be retired as we are switching the way that we do merchandise. Use the promo code MARCHOBSERVER and grab some of these styles before they are gone forever. We greatly appreciate your support. Lots of new things coming in Observer World this month. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.